Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Savior Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Welcome to this channel. My name is Akila. If you want to subscribe, you may hit on the subscribe button. If you want to be notified on the videos that are posted, as I post on a daily basis, hit on the notification button. Do not forget to like, to share, and comment on my videos. Welcome as I usher you to God's greatness and to the love affairs in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you so much, beloved. The love and the support that you keep on showing me on this on this channel. May God richly bless you. Today I want to share a testimony that I've been willing to share, but I still felt um, I felt that it was not it was not the time. However, God has been has been has been speaking about it over and over and over. So um, I just want to share on how um, God ordained the spouse that I had. How God actually came to say, this is a spouse, hallelujah. So God today is saying, you also thought he was your godly, he was your godly ordained spouse. You also thought the person was the one. So the testimony that I want to share today is that there was a point in life when I started dating. And when I started dating the current partner that I had, I believed and I was sure that this one came from God. I thought this one is the one. I was assured that this one is the one. The first thing that made me to be assured that this one is the one, it is because he was the man of God. We were together in the assembly he was the preacher. He was he was just a man of God, somebody whom uh, you could relate your life with. And I felt that God has sent me the angel. God has sent me the one. So when we were in a relationship, it happens that um, everything was just fine. We were following the principles of the word of God. But to a shock of my life, this one year, we were on our third year at varsity. This one year, I got a call from a friend saying this person is getting married. Actually, we are at, we are at his wedding. While I was still thinking we are together, we are on the same page, there is nothing that maybe had made us to fight or being in a different uh, dimension regarding our relationship. But then... I received a call to say, this person is getting married with someone else today. We are actually at the wedding. And we thought maybe you are not at the wedding because you will be embarrassed or humiliated that he left for someone else. He left you for someone else. But God has a different way, has a different person for my life. God has ordained someone, the one I thought is everything that I needed, the one I thought is the one that I want. I even um, have words to say, if I don't get married to this one, then it simply means marriage was never made for me. But then God had somebody in my life. God had ordained somebody and not at that year. Five years after that's where God had gave me this pause that was mine. So today you thought the person you were with was the one. You can't even move on because of the things that had happened. But if you are a child of God, God today is saying you might have desired for a certain person, but God also had desired a set, had ordained somebody else for you. God is saying, wait upon the voice of the Lord. Things may look like, yes, this, are, this is confirmed by God. But when the process and when the work of God change from what you desire, you must also move with what God has given, what God has ordained for you. It, the Bible says everything works together for good for those who love and believe in the word of God. Everything that God has shifted into his direction, into his purpose, it will work for good, it will work for good for you as well. It will work good for you as well. Well, stay blessed and continue to watch this channel in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen.